Welcome to our webinar, Walking Through MAPE's new website. Thank you for joining us. We're excited to share our new, redesigned, award-winning website with you. If you have any questions during the presentation, please type them in the question and answer box on the side of your screen. We'll address them at the end of the session or via email, because this is going to be a very full presentation. We have a lot of new and very powerful features to discuss. So without any further ado, let me introduce our presenter, Josiane Thibault. Josiane is the Operational Marketing Manager from APEI. She's a graduate of St. Foy College, where she graduated with a DCS, which is a Quebec Diploma of College Studies in Art and Graphic Design. She's worked at MAPEI for more than 20 years, and she oversaw the development of the new website for MAPEI Corporation. Over to you, Jos. Thank you, Jen. So today, I uh, want to welcome you uh, to join me on doing a, a tour of our new MAPEI website. Uh, like Jen said, we have a lot to talk about, and I'm going to try to give you a general overview of everything that's available and everything that's new. Uh, I'll do a quick introduction and then we'll specifically look at the home page and the navigation menu. I will also uh, dive in and look at specific new features and tools and we will also go over our new MAPE app. So um, <clears throat> to start I just want to give you a quick look at uh, our old website, uh, for those of you who are familiar with the old website, we went from uh, this design to our new uh, modern design, uh, also a different uh, orientation, new navigation menu, and uh, brand new technology. Uh, the new site is responsive, which means that it fits any device. So if you use uh, a desktop, a tablet, or a phone visiting the site, it will fit the screen. So it's uh, much more user friendly. A few things I want to mention before uh, we start is uh, to make sure to have the best experience browsing our new site is to use a supported uh, browser. For example, uh, Google Chrome, uh, Microsoft Edge, uh, Firefox and Safari are good options and uh, will give you the best uh, experience. Something to keep in mind as well is to uh, uh, expect new, uh, new content regularly. So you visit the site one day uh, and a week later you will see new content, uh, new products. We add blogs, videos, uh, articles. So uh, check back often to see uh, our new content. And uh, lastly, I also wanted to let you know that I'm going to go very quick today on, on certain areas of the site and new features. So I just want to invite you back to come uh, visit it at your leisure and, and explore further. So <clears throat> here I'm going to share my screen and uh, we'll take a look at the home page in the top menu navigation. So here you can see uh, the home page. I'm going to type in Mape.us just to refresh the page and you can take a look at the navigation sorry as well as a little quick view of the home page so we'll take it section by section uh, here you see at the bottom on the top uh, the bottom right a little button and you click on that and it just takes you right back to the top so in addition to the new navigation we have a home page slider that you can uh, use to view what we're featuring and click on the button here to read more about a different topic uh, below that we have uh, quick links that will take you to our most popular tools our product calculator video library warranty page and architectural solutions uh, right below we have uh, MAPE in the USA, so it's a little bit more about us. You can click on that. Our facts and figures, which are static, are not clickable. 
The featured solutions are clickable, so each of those topics uh, can expand and you can read more about them. And those will change periodically, so feel free to come back and take a look at our featured solutions. System solutions, uh, we currently feature these four, and I'll show you the system solutions a little bit later on. Rialta Mape, so we always feature articles on the homepage, as well as um, the, the most recent edition, currently showing uh, number 31, which we just published. And the button below can take you to the magazine, the uh, other articles and other issues. Health and environment is also featured on the homepage, as well as uh, login to my Mape area. So if you already, uh, you can sign up, or if you already uh, signed up, you can log in from this area. Okay, now we'll look at the top navigation, so starting with the search. The search bar at the top expands when you click on it. So you can type, if you're looking for a product, here let's type Ultraflex LFT. <clears throat> so you get uh, LFT as well as other products that start with Ultraflex. For a quick search. Next, MyMape. Again, you can log in and register from here. Our languages that are available, our site is in English and Spanish. Next, Contact Us page, Career page, News and Events, Where to Buy, and we'll come back to some of those pages to look at them in more detail. Here we have About Us. Um, we have the MAPE group on the left uh, featuring uh, our, uh, our global history and uh, different um, uh, information about the group and also the MAPE in the USA which are local information. Uh, health and environment is here, ISO and industry certification, business management policy, our trade show schedule, sustainability report, MAPE in the community, industry links, and MAPE location here in the US. Next is our project reference page. So it's divided in global projects. It's a global library, as well as the US projects. Products and solutions here features all our product lines. So you can see all 12 here listed and they're all clickable links. System solutions, again, another way to find our system solutions. In the spotlight, feature different pages here and we'll be adding uh, to this area regularly. So right now we're featuring those three. And all products, which is another place to search for products. Our next menu is our Rialta Magazine page. Uh, so we'll look at this one a little bit later training and technical support, which uh, features our MAPE Technical Institute in-person training, <clears throat> as well as uh, the online trainings, our blog, Tech Talk blog, and our video library. Next, tools and downloads. This one is packed with information as well starting with technical library, where to buy tool, which is next, and it's another way to find that tool, our warranties, our grout color palette, tools for architects, CADs and specs, health and environment, video again, product information library, and our product calculators. So this is a tour of the of the home page and uh, the navigation menu. I will now dive into sections of the site and give you uh, more information about um, the new tools and their features. I want to start with MyMapay. <clears throat> MyMapay is a brand new area where you can uh, register one time and uh, be able to customize this section for you. So you can save things like products, articles, projects, uh, solutions, videos, 
Uh, you can also, uh, at the same time, uh, while you register, you can uh, sign up for our newsletter and our Rialta magazine. Uh, you can also uh, sign up for trainings when you're logged in and also uh, view the trainings you sign up for in your MyMapay area. You can also comment on, your, on our blogs while you're logged in and save calculations that you'll be uh, when you, while using our calculators and also uh, save cost estimates. So uh, what's interesting to note is that if you also have the new MAPE app, uh, you can just log in to the MAPE app with the same MyMAPE registration credentials that you've, uh, uh, when you sign up on the website, and uh, the two accounts will sync. So for example, if you're on your phone and you save a video, uh, next time you go back to your computer and log in, that video will be saved on your desktop as well. So the two sync. So let me share my screen again and show you. Uh, my MyMapay is found at the top right of the screen. Uh, when you click on that, you can see here, I can log in because I'm already registered. Or you can sign up by clicking this button. This is the form you'll fit in, fill in one time and you'll sub submit it. When you submit the form, MAPE will send you an email to confirm that you are in fact uh, subscribing to my MAPE and uh, it's really you uh, subscribing. So once you've uh, confirmed your account, you can log in and I'll log in here in my account and show you what it looks like. <clears throat> so once you log in, you see your uh, initials. <laughs> This is my initials, so I'll show you my MAPEI account. <clears throat> Here you see my name on the left in the different menus. Uh, scrolling down, you'll see your information, so everything you've filled in the form. So this is where you can go to maybe update your address or change your password. And uh, on this page, you also see the MAPE communications that you can subscribe to. So the first one is a Rialta MAPE digital, so you can uh, sign up to receive it digitally. You can also sign up to the version in the mail. You can sign up for the international Rialta MAPE magazine, as well as our newsletter. So once you've made your selection, you save your preferences, and you're signed up. Uh, next section is uh, in your favorites. So this is where I mentioned you can save products, solutions, projects, articles, and videos. So here you see the things that I've saved. So this is how they display. And so you can add and remove <clears throat> to your MAPE area. Only you see this area, by the way. Uh, next section is trainings. So currently we don't have any in-person training, but I left those older trainings just to show you what it would look like if you were to sign up to one and it would save right here. Next, calculations. So here you can save calculations that you've made with our product calculators. Uh, here I've got a bunch of test saves uh, just to show you how they display and what it looks like. You can easily delete one. It will just make sure and ask you to confirm you want to delete it. And that's it. So your information uh, is not shared. Uh, just so you know, when we uh, receive uh, your, um, your registration, we, MAPE doesn't share your information. It's really just to uh, sign, unless you sign up and subscribe to uh, anything that we offer you, but otherwise we don't share your contact information. Next is contact us page. So we have a brand new page, uh, fairly simple, but I think we made it uh, very easy to use. So you can contact us by email or by phone, and uh, the page is right here at the top, also towards the left. I'm going to show you the new layout. Uh, so we've uh, added these six icons, which are easy for you to uh, access and, and help you refine, you know, your uh, basically your inquiries. So we have the uh, request for grout samples, 
product information, customer service, troubleshooting, where to buy, which is going to our where to buy tool, and other. So if you have an, an inquiry related to products, it makes it easy to just click on that, fill in the form, let us know what you're interested in or what you want to know, and uh, we will you know, get back to you. Um, if you're interested in samples, uh, of course, we will also uh, ask you for information, but in this case, we'll need your address to be able to mail you those samples. So each of the form are customized based on the type of request. So it just makes it easier uh, for everybody. And here at the bottom, we have the traditional, you know, by mail, contact us, our customer service and technical service numbers, which are, uh, hot links so if you're on your phone uh, you can always touch the uh, phone numbers and call us directly product calculators so showing you here uh, we have 11 product calculators now um, you can obviously calculate material also add a cost estimate which is something new we didn't have before uh, you can save print and share also uh, so let me show you you can access the, the uh, product calculator through uh, the uh, homepage right here, this icon, and also from the top menu, which is the last tool to the right. <clears throat> Here's the page, features our 11 calculators, caulk, sealants, and joint fillers, construction grouts, exterior finishing, floor covering adhesives, levelers and toppings, mortar beds and cutlery repair mortars, patches and skim coat, primers and coatings, sheet membrane and reinforcing mesh and fabric, tile grout and tile mortars. So I'm just clicking here on tile grout, filling in uh, some information just to show you how it works. You can pick US measurements or metric, depending on your preference. Also add some overage, five, 10, 15%. And here you get the results. So at the top, you see the information you put in and below the results. So at this point, you can add a cost estimate or save to MyMapay. If you add a cost estimate, you can also uh, save again or new calculation uh, or just go back to the tool and pick a different calculator. But you can share Facebook on LinkedIn or email, either yourself or someone, or print. So here, let me do a new calculation. So just clears the tool so you can pick a different product and start again. Or if you click the back button, it takes you right here to this page and you can pick a different calculator. So if you just want to do a new calculation in the same calculator, it's best to use the uh, new calculation button because the back button will take you back to this page here. Tools for architects. Uh, this page is basically uh, a page that we've uh, put quick access to a lot of content that you know you need. Uh, so you'll see a lot of things that I shared in the top menu navigation on this page. It, and it's again, just to make it easy for you. So this page features our CADs and specs, our uh, grout palette, color palette, sustainability documentation, quick access to system solutions, uh, our project references, and more. So let me show you. Here, uh, the Tools for Architects can be uh, accessed through the Tools and Downloads menu, right here, Tools for Architects, or on the homepage, Architectural Solutions. Here's the page. Uh, here we have six quick uh, access icons to various things we know you like to uh, reference, our project reference, our CAD spec guide, and the below two sections here uh, are unique to this page. So those are not found anywhere else. Our uh, master guide specification on uh, the RCAT and sys uh, master spec. We also show uh, have links directly to MAPE Spec Maestro and we feature three, these three divisions, maintenance of cast in place concrete, moisture vapor emission control, and the tile and stone setting materials and accessories. On this page, we also have uh, a place where you can uh, request information for our CEU. 
uh, trainings. We also have a quick link to our products and system warranties and different ways to contact us depending on what you're interested in. So just diving into these six uh, quick links at the top, we'll look at each of them, starting with system solutions brochures. For those of you who are familiar with our brochures, we have uh, hospitality, uh, we have these four currently, healthcare, residential high-rise, and marine. But we're always adding more, so feel free to come back and check it out. Just showing you one here, it will open a PDF, which you can download or just view, like I'm doing right now. Scrolling down, you see this specific one is featuring all those system solutions. And I'm going to show you what they look like. So here we present them with some detail about a challenge or an application with the solutions that my, the solution that MAPE is uh, recommending, a list of products, as well as a 3D rendering that features the products used in a system. So here's one example, another uh, below grade waterproofing example, exterior facade, uh, system solutions for balconies, and uh, another example here of uh, coatings. So I think you get the idea. So those are our brochures. <clears throat> Going back to Tools for Architects, the next quick link is to our three-part guide specifications. So here are documents that you can download in uh, Word and modify for your projects. This page features our tile and stone installation systems, floor covering installation systems, and our structural waterproofing systems. Next, system solutions package. That's brand new. I want to show you what it looks like. So you land on the same page as where our brochures are, but notice there's a search bar above. And if you scroll down, you can also see the four icons and our solutions. So it's the same solutions that are in the brochure, but presented in a more interactive way. So you can click on System Solutions here, this button, to view them all, or through the menu right here. So here you can search, again, by those four categories or by keyword search or by those different menus that we have here that just filters down your search. But if you know what you're looking for, like I'm gonna type shower, and it will produce the results. So here I'm shown with four options, just clicking on one. As you can see, they are very uh, similar to our brochure solutions. Uh, we have some information and our 3D rendering. The difference is, uh, is that you can share those uh, solutions here. So again, on Facebook and LinkedIn, as well as email, you can also save them in MyMapay and print. Another difference is the list of products. Uh, so all those links are clickable. And so if you wanna view a product page, for example, it will open in a new tab uh, and you can see the product documentation and read about the products but you can also go right back to your system solution and another difference is the download uh, feature so you can download everything all the data sheet and sds's as well as uh, sustainability documents you can pick and choose where you want to download or just download everything so here i'm making my selection and then downloading Depending on how many documents you're downloading, it might take a little bit longer. Uh, here I've seen my download uh, up, so it was pretty quick. Okay, going back to Tools for Architects. Next is our growth uh, and um, 
uh, cock color palette. Our new page uh, is showing our color collection. So that's how MAPE uh, presents the color palette. So here all our colors are divided in color collections. At the top of the page, you can see, you can select the collection if you know which one uh, you want to you know, consult and clicking on it will take you right there. If you know the color you're interested in, when you click on it, it will tell you which product is available in that color. So that's pretty cool. If you click on a product, then it will take you to the product page. And it's also interesting to note that each grout also has their uh, the color palette uh, on the page. So that's another place to look for colors. Going back to the color palette. At the top, we also have a PDF that you can view or download. It includes all our colors, including our uh, Flex Color 3D uh, effects and our new Ultra Color Plus Max black and white. So that's a PDF that you can download. And you can also search by products on the grout color palette. So if you know the product you want to use and see which colors are available, click on the product and it will show you the different colors available. Another way to search is by product type. So we've got these four categories here. And if you click on them, it will take you to all the products that are included in that product category and show you, here I selected our sealant, so you can see uh, Caracolor S, and it shows all the colors that are available and all the different products in that category. Many colors. <laughs> Okay, going back to tools for architects, we have a quick link to our Rialta magazine page. So on this page, uh, we always feature the latest issue as well as our archives. So you can uh, consult the issues or download the PDF. So this is the archives page of the full issues. Uh, you see here the North America version and again you can download or consult online and you also we also feature the MAPE International Rialta MAPE past issues. Back on the Rialta page uh, you can search articles by keywords or edition as well as by article type. So if you know you're interested in the product spotlight or a project article, you can select that. Also feel free to browse down the page to see what articles we feature and they change periodically as we add more articles. So let me just show you one article as an example. Again, you can uh, share the articles you can save to read later or reference later and print. Uh, articles have different, you know, multimedia. This one has pictures, others have videos. Um, we also have, in this case, uh, the project information because it's a case study and the products that were used in this specific project. That gives you an overview of our Rialto page. Health and environment, that's another area of the site that is really packed with good information. You'll see here, we've got six pages, uh, lots to look at. Obviously, I don't have time to go through it all today. I'm gonna just browse quickly here and um, show you the one page here. Lots of information, also interactive, lots of things 
to read about and learn about. So Tools for Architects also has a quick link to this area of our site. Again, uh, another existing area are project references. So as I mentioned, this area is, select, is available in global and US project. The global page, which is this one, um, sh uh, features the search bar. So you can search by keywords, by category, or you can also search by application, by products, if you know the product, a specific product you're looking for, or by country. So here I'll just pick USA. So it filters all the project from the country. Showing you an example, that's another thing you can share on the site. Uh, you can also save in MyMapA and print. Here's information about the project, some pictures, and the products that were used. Just show you a, a little bit, another example of how to search for projects. So here I can just pick a category, let's say infrastructures, an application, structural reinforcement, and US. So that filters down uh, projects. So here's another one. So again, information about the project, some pictures. Here we're featuring uh, a case study. So we have case studies and a Rialta Mape international article about this project and all the products that were used. So those are all clickable. Okay, going back to our tools for architects. One last tool I wanna share with you is our CAD inspect guide. So on the, with this tool, you can search in different ways. Uh, first, there's the keyword search bar at the top. So if you know what you're looking for, you can type it right here or installation category. So here I'm gonna select one and then another menu will appear and the some of the results will start to show on, on the right. The industry method, so if you know it, you can select that and the application type, and then it filters down your search. So here we found this one. You can reset and start again, just giving you some examples here. Waterproofing type, application, just making selections to show you how to filter down your selection. So now you can uh, download now, which might take a little bit of time, uh, depending on how many documents are included in this uh, CAD inspect. So it wasn't so long, but sometimes it might take longer. So here, these are the documents I, um, I downloaded. So by clicking view documents, you can see here, I've got a DWG, a PDF, and a uh, spec in Word. Above, I have data sheets. So if I didn't want the data sheet, I could just unselect them and click download and would only download those attachments. You can also click this button and only download the DWG, for example. Okay. Uh, this is a keyword search. If you know what you're looking for, again, I'm looking for shower, gives me those results. I can download now again, or view documents, which is my preferred uh, method. And that way I know what I'm downloading. I can make my selection. This one specifically has more documents. We have a, a CAD spec available in uh, Word, um, a CAD spec PDF, uh, the spec in a Word doc, as well as the DWG. And again, you can uh, pick and choose and just download individual files or select download 
all. It's up to you. So that's it for our CADS and spec guide and our tools for architects. I uh, just want to mention that every day, every week, we add more to this tool, uh, CADS and spec. So we make sure that we put fresh content. And so we're uh, currently updating a lot of our CADS and our specifications for you. And we uh, are constantly adding more. Okay, next thing I want to discuss is the where to buy tool. Uh, it's the way it works is if you use a browser and you uh, that allows uh, pinning your location, you can pin your location, uh, or you can just enter a, uh, your location with a zip code or a specific location. I'll show you. Uh, there's a menu to filter down your search, uh, and then you access distributor or retailer's location, and you can also get directions. That tool is at the top right here in the middle where to buy. So here I'm gonna type in my zip code, search. And it will give you a lot of information uh, showing you the map and on the left, uh, the, the distributor available. I can uh, filter down my search by radius. So I selected 20 miles here, distributor, by type of store. And also I can filter down by product line. So if you know the line you're interested in, here are the filters that I use. If you want to take one out, you can delete it or just reset and start again. But on the left, you have contact information and you also uh, have the map. So you can pin your location right here and see who's the closest to you and get the route. So if you click on route, you can see here the route. You can all click on the, also click on the left to the, the distributors on the menu and do the same thing. Find them on the map, get the, the directions. So here you see the type of information we have available, their address, their phone numbers, website, emails, etc. So lots of information here. Okay, next topic. Uh, here I want to talk about products and product lines. Uh, the main thing I wanted to uh, show you, because I've shown you product pages earlier, but here is more on how to search for products on our website. There's many, many ways, and I want to go through uh, all of them just to uh, show you the differences. So uh, this is what we're going to talk about, as well as a quick overview of product line hubs. So first way to search for products is obviously the top search uh, on the right. We looked at it a little bit earlier. So what I wanna point out here is when you search and you click on the product to view the product page, you can consult the data sheet and view the different documentation, read about it. When you click back, it will take you back to that search. You can view another product and again, clicking the back button will preserve the search. Okay, so this is the first way. Another way to search for product is uh, clicking on product lines right here. So we'll get a search bar, type your product name. Once you click a product name, a product line bar will also appear. Obviously, the search will produce also some results. Uh, but uh, if you don't know what you're looking for, you can click on a line and then a subline menu will appear and you can look, look up products this way. So here I'm looking for a carpet adhesive. So if you don't know the product name, this is a good way to search. Another way is clicking on the product line hubs. So here, got Map of Heat, kind of went fast. Let me show you. Those are all the lines that we have. So on all those pages, you'll have a search bar at the top. So you can keyword or by category. So they each have the category. So again, if you don't know the product name, you can just uh, go here 
The difference with this search bar is that if you click back after you consulted a product, it won't take you back to the search, but back to this page, so the product line hub. That's the difference. One last, uh, not the last one, another way to search is all products. So here again, you get a similar search bar as the other page, uh, keyword search or product line and category. So here it's producing results. So if you don't know again the product name, it's a good way to search. Okay, one last way to search is in Tools and Downloads Product Information Library. This tool is to search quickly for products, but also to download documentation quickly. Not so much to browse and read, but let me show you here. If I look for Ultraflex, it finds all the products that start with Ultraflex. And I can pick and choose the ones I want to download documentation for. So you click on the plus and it will add them to your cart. So here I selected three, click on that little flap and you see the three products I've selected. You see all the, the documents that are included. You can select your language and you can also click and you know, unclick things you don't want and download. So again, depending on how many you're downloading, it might take you know, longer, just depends. Here I have three, so it was pretty quick. Okay, another uh, feature of this page is you can search by product line. What's cool about this is that you can pick more than one. So here I'm gonna select a few, just to show you. And they appear here. So if you didn't want something, you can always remove it. Uh, you can also add a keyword if it's too many products and you wanna you know, look for something you know it's called for example ultra color then it will pare down the search um, if you click on the product name you'll get this bar this menu and again it's to do a quick download so you just click that it downloads the data sheet the sds or anything else so that's a good way to find the product and do a quick download This page also features a colors, uh, the colors, search by the color. So uh, if you know the color you're looking for and you want to see what product is available in that color, you click on the color and the tool will show you the products that are available in that color. So in this case, I have these two. I want to add them to my cart. I forgot to reset my cart, so I need to delete those Ultraflex products I've already downloaded. And now I'm ready to do the download of those two new products. The page also uh, features documentation type. So that's another way you can filter products by. So here I've selected all the EPDs, all the products that have EPDs. And we add, we're adding a lot of products, uh, a lot of, uh, excuse me, documentation types to, to this page. Uh, soon we will have VOC and many others. All right, so let me now show you, go back to the product line hub and show you um, a little bit of what's on them. We've only looked at the top, uh, top of each of them. So here you can find them in products and solutions. And they're all here. So I'm again going back to Mapa Heat, scrolling down to show you what's available. So here is only content related to the floor warming system line. So you have the technical library for this line. So you can click on those little triangles to kind of collapse or open those sections. We got some videos. Here we feature different uh, news and events, Rialta articles, and contact us. I'm going to show you another one the floor covering line. So, again, the search bar is available there, some featured products. 
technical documentation related to this line, system solutions here, project references related to this line, lots of information, but only about this specific line. Okay, last one here, products for sport flooring. So content is displayed just based on what's available for this line and how we wanna you know, feature them. So that's it. Okay, our next uh, section is training and technical support. So here again, tons of information related to our trainings, uh, whether they're in person or online. Upcoming and past webinars are also found in this section, our blog and our video library. So it's found right here at the top in the menu, training and technical support. Uh, it features our in-person training, online trainings, our blog, like I said, and our videos. So let me click on this page first. So this per page will give you information about our in-person training and the ones that we are providing, as well as uh, other trainings that we do uh, at customer location, lunch and learns, and also a demonstration at trade shows and different conferences. Here are our location in North America where we have uh, trainings in the MAPE locations and more information about technical service and how to contact us. Our in-person training program right now is um, we don't have any available uh, schedule due to COVID-19 but if you were to look for a training in the future this would be the page you would be going to. So we currently feature, um, so this was the page right here, I currently feature online training. So I'm gonna show you the online trainings right now. On this page, we have uh, information about our CEU program. So you can request information here. We also have our webinars. So right now we're showing <laughs> the webinar we're having. So this one will be going away. Uh, after this, but there are others that you can sign up for, for example, uh, these three. So you would uh, just click on the links and here I'm featuring one that will be on June 30th and you just sign up and register and that's it, you can participate. Uh, next is our uh, web webinar library so all our past webinars are stored here so you can go back and view the recordings and here is a quick link to our video library as well uh, here at the bottom is contact information if you want to learn more about a, a webinar program or contact us for a ceu uh, this is the link to click next i want to show our our blog TikTok blog, so again, keyword search, uh, category search, so you've got these general categories for you to sort blog posts by, or you can click on a blogger and find their uh, blogs. Let me just show you one real quick. This is also something that you can uh, share and email as well as print. And you can leave a comment, but you'll need to be logged into my MAPE in order to be able to leave a comment. So blogs have, you know, various things, links to products, pictures, videos. Um, they're all a little bit different. I'm just showing you one here and we have a little bit about the author. And at the bottom, you always have the ability to sign in, to leave a comment or sign up. Next is our video library. So in this, uh, on this page, uh, you've got lots of content 
And again, you can search by keyword or category, video category. So we feature all those different video category. Browsing down the page, you'll see them. And you can also click on show all if you're interested in a specific category and it will just filter those specific videos. Videos feature uh, product links. So if they mention a product, it will be linked below for easy access. And you can save them to watch them later or reference them later. Here are our past webinars. So here, if I look for search for grout, so you get all the videos that mention grout in their description, you can click this link and it will open full screen and play the video or on the video uh, image itself, it will play in the small screen, uh, but it will also be, uh, it, you'll be able to expand it by this icon here to go full screen. And then there's this click, click copy link rather. Uh, when you click on that, it lets you copy the link and you can email someone. Again, save and the products. So that's it for video library. Okay, we're running out of time, I gotta hurry up. <laughs> Technical library and warranties. So in this section, which is the last section I wanna really uh, share with you today, uh, it features our product catalogs and brochures. You also find our technical documentation and our, I'll show you another page which uh, has all our warranties. Okay, so the technical library is found in the tools and download menu. Last tool on the left, technical library right here. So this tool has all the documents that are on the website, um, not the data sheets, but um, it features all the lines as you can see. And these are the types of documents that are here. So brochures, manuals, catalogs, and technical documentation. So if you uh, use those filters to look for something, for example, if I look for grout again, so that will clear my search. Okay, so now I've got everything about grout, but if I wanna search for talent stone grout and also look for technical documents not brochures i can make that selection and the tool will filter everything available about that topic okay resetting my search uh, here i can look for catalogs for example and it will show me all the catalogs available if I just want talent stone catalogs, I can add that filter and it will show me only the two related to that product line. Okay. Warranties are found right here. So it's a dedicated page just to warranties. Um, on this page, you have our brochure at the top, the blue button that explains our program and the different lines that feature different uh, limited warranties. So those are all downloadable PDFs. That's it. So that's it for the website features and tools. Uh, I also wanted to show you briefly our uh, new MAPE app. Uh, so I'll take a few minutes uh, to tell you about it. Uh, our new app uh, basically needs to be uh, installed. So it's not an update. Uh, you'll have to delete the old app and install a brand new app. So it means you'll need to go to the App Store or the Google Play Store to find it and download it again. It will uh, feature all our product lines, all our products, all our calculators, uh, our where to buy tool locator, as well as a uh, selection of our videos and our latest edition of Rialto Mape. Um, so if you go on our website with your phone, you can uh, look for the quick uh, download button 
in the slider banner. So if you look for this banner of the app right here, you click on download, it will take you to this landing page. And by clicking to the App Store or the Google Play uh, button with your phone, it will let you download it. So here I'm browsing with my computer, so it doesn't let me download it on the App Store, but with your phone, it will be letting you download. And here's the same for the Google Play link. Another way to find this landing page on our site, in case you don't remember the banner, you can all the way, all the, go all the way to the bottom, Mape app icon, and you get to the same landing page with those quick links. So that's it for the Mape app. <clears throat> so I want to thank, thank everyone for uh, joining me today, and I hope you learn a few things and you saw uh, our new uh, features and tools. Um, I'm not sure if we have time for uh, many questions right now, but um, if you go and if you email us at mapedigital at mape.com, I will make sure that we answer all your questions and we get, uh, get back to you uh, quickly. I uh, also remind you that this uh, webinar is recorded and so you can always go back uh, to listen to it again. I know I went quickly on a lot of sections uh, but uh, I wanted to be able to show you as much as possible. Thank you again. Back to you Jen. Thank you Josiane and thank you everyone for joining us this afternoon. Uh, we really appreciate your time and we'll see you next week for our next webinar. Thanks again. This concludes our presentation.